As with previous phones in the range, the SSROG Phone 6 Pro goes big on the core components. The headline specs are a cutting-edge Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 chip and a large 6.8 inches OLED display with a rapid 165Hz maximum refresh rate. It also squeezes in a very large 6000 mAh battery, or rather, two 3000 mAh batteries, which can be charged by either USB-C port. There's a second one on the left edge, which is better suited to charging while gaming. The latter also facilitates a bundled-in Aeroactive Cooler 6 fan, which adds four physical shoulder buttons into the mix. The phone itself gives you two touch-sensitive air triggers, which enhance certain competitive games immeasurably. It's worth pointing out that the SS ROG Phone 6 Pro and ROG Phone 6 are essentially the same phones, with the Pro model merely adding an extra 2GB of RAM, 18GB vs 16GB, and a tiny ROG Vision Color Mold display on the back. SS hasn't changed things too much on the design front. This is still every inch the gamer-focused smartphone it intends to be, which means it's far from subtle. First things, it's downright huge. At 173 by 77 by 10.3 mm and with a weight of 239g, it's not the kind of phone that's going to disappear into your pocket. It's not going to melt into the background when it's outside your pocket, either. The Pro only comes in the one color, a shiny storm white with icy blue accents, including a completely blue Nano SIM tray and power button. There are splashes of text and futuristic decals dotted all around the frosted glass rear and the camera module is sharp and angular, too. There's also a light-up dare-to-play slogan, as well as a small ROG Vision Mold display that outputs a range of contextual animations. Around the front, Essus has admirably stuck to its gaming brief, keeping the selfie camera away from the screen. This is achieved thanks to bulky top and bottom bezels, which also enable a meaty pair of front-firing speakers. There are a total of two USB-C ports, one on the bottom edge and one on the left-hand edge, the latter of which makes landscape charging easier and also powers the bundled-in Aeroactive Cooler 6 fan. All in all it's a solid, reasonably premium-feeling phone, though that sense of quality is somewhat undermined by a lowly IPX4 rating.